Welcome back to Sally Face. The cultists took everything from us. I'm gonna take this off. Oh, nope. Yep. This is the finale of Sally Face. This is the last time, possibly the last time I'm ever gonna be playing Sally Face on my channel. So I hope you guys enjoy the epic conclusion of Sally Face. So let's get right in to episode five. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Memories and dreams. Start a new game on episode five, yes. I'd like to thank Steve Gabry, the developer of this game for sending me this game early. This game changed my life. It changed my audience's life. And the fandom is strong and I will say it is well deserved. Oh, ah! I can't believe it. Ash is a little bit older now. She used to have the really long, pretty hair in her teenage years. She's walking through a graveyard of everybody that we've lost. Loving wife to Herman Sanderson, 1951 to 1992. Loving husband to Cassandra Sanderson. Oh. Robert Silva? Rotten pieces. <laughs> 1969 to 1999. Morrison. Ray and Janice's shared grave. Even death couldn't keep those two apart. Chug died? I, like, my memory, dude. Son, husband, father, friend. Everybody died in 1999. Hey, Chug, I miss you, dude. Soda? I, I can't. Larry? Son of Lisa and Jim Johnson. Oh, Larry. They never did find Larry's body. I have chills, I have chills. Lisa Johnson Fisher. Mother of Larry Johnson, wife of Henry Fisher. Lisa was always so nice to me. She treated me like family. Henry Fisher? Husband of Lisa Johnson Fisher. Father to Sal Fisher. Sal. I can't imagine how much this hurts Sal. Oh no. It's Sal's grave. Son of Henry and Diane Fisher. He lived until 2004. I wish you were here, Sal. Sal. Oh, I can't believe Sal died. There's the mask and everything. Sorry I haven't visited in a few nights. Things have gotten worse. It's a war zone out here. It's been five months since Todd escaped from the institution. I hope he's okay. Todd went crazy. And now he's escaped? That's good to know. He's gotta be under that darn church. It's the one place we haven't been able to get to. They're down there. I know they are, and they have my Todd. Did you get the rest of that C4 from your army friend? Whoa, what are we planning to do? I got it last night. Have you found a way in? I think so, yeah. We should go Tuesday night. That's when they're least active. Remember our agreement. If we get caught down there... We won't. We're going to get Todd and then blow that place to bits. Neil, I'm serious. So am I, but if we do get caught, then yeah, we take him down with us. I'm ready. Good, I mean, at least one of us is. Notes? Todd, he's been infected by the dark. There's been a darkness just going across this town, infecting everybody, and Todd has completely lost his lucidity. Now we gotta go to the church because it's the entry point for the temple that we need to get into to save our friends. Oof, I'm a mess right now. I'm just way too excited for this game. <laughs> Sal's room? Oh, this is Sal's old room. He loved his masks and his heavy metal. Oh, and his cat, Gizmo? Hi, Gizmo. Do you need anything? He hasn't left your room since the execution. It's like he knows. The animals are always the first to know. The basement. Whoa, 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 whoa. Maple? Hey, Maple. How are you today? <laughs> eee! Okay, then. Neil and I are gonna get Todd back soon, and sorry, but we may have to stick him in there with you. At least until we can figure out a better solution. I hope you don't mind. <laughs> oh. I've gotta run to the shed real quick because when I get back in, we'll have you some nice warm soup. <laughs> oh geez, that is just not okay. The darkness in this town is just crazy. Oh, there's everyone's stickers and there's my gloom sticker right above Ash's head. More notes. Maple has become a threat to herself and others and must be locked up. Her screaming finally stopped, but she's not looking so great. We can't get her to eat anything. She's still refusing to eat. She's starting to smell pretty bad. Ugh, what a demise. All right, I'm gonna go to the shed. Oi, 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 oi. That's not it. Oh, right, it's... Oh, hmm. glad she remembers, because I sure wouldn't. Todd's notes. I'm not sure exactly who the child of abomination is, but if they're really an enemy of the cult, then they could be a much needed ally. He was planning some stuff. Poor Todd, oh, the package. 
Yes, we grab that package. We got these weird pyramid things in the mail. Another package from our mysterious cultist insider. Todd had a third pyramid in the shed. In his notes, he said that he found it in the temple under the old apartments. They seem to be pretty important. There are several mentions of a prophecy in Todd's notes about them. He was actively looking for the other two. You listen? I put these nice pyramids around you. I think they might be linked to you somehow, Sal. No matter how I turn these, nothing happens. I thought something would happen this time. Sal, there's something else I need to tell you. What is it? The replacements were sloppy at first, but they're getting better now. It's harder to tell the difference. I can't trust anyone. Those things creep me out, dude. They aren't human. I know what you mean. So you think that pyramid thing that Todd found could help us find Sal? It seems like it. I've pieced together what I could find about the old cult prophecies. And from what I can tell, there are three pyramids that will summon their destruction. All signs point to Sal as the one who can stop them. I'm not sure how or why, but it's the best chance we have. I always knew Sally Face would do great things. Don't give up on him, Ash. You have to find him. I won't. Ever. I just need to find the other two pyramids. Once I'm free of this forsaken treehouse, I'll help you find them. Larry, I don't know if this is a good idea. What if burning down the treehouse only makes things worse? Trust me, it can't get any worse. I can't live like this anymore. Or, you know, not live, but whatever. I can't stay stuck in this place. You don't know what it's like. It's torture. I can feel it changing me. Nothing else has worked to break the binding spell. What if you end up in the black room instead of being free? Your soul will dissolve into the darkness. We don't know that for sure, and even so, the nothingness will be better than existing like this. Please, Ash, you have to help me. If I do this, you have to promise me you'll be okay. Promise me you won't fade away. I promise. <laughs> you better amend that promise, Larry. We burnt this giant tree house down. And it's a long fall from down there, as we've seen. I went back to the burnt tree every night for weeks. He's just gone. He's gone. I can't bring myself to go anymore. Another screw up in a long list of my failures. This morning, I went over to Neil's place, but... Hello? Neil? Are you home? Neil? I grabbed the C4 from Neil's bag since we were supposed to go to the temple that night. Maybe I have to go to Sal's room. Hmm. Maybe the basement. <gasps> no! Maple got out! No! Oh, crap, this isn't good! That sounded like the front door! Ah! Nope, 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 no! Who came in this house? A letter? There was a note left on the table for me. Ash, they have Maple and Neil. You need to move quickly. The temple is lightly guarded today. Sneak into the entrance I told you about before. Once you get into the main chamber, you'll have to act stealthily. There are four pillars with inserts that hold the sacred jars. If you place the explosives there, it's sure to bring the whole place down. Stick them behind the jars and they'll be safe. It's forbidden to touch those jars. Be careful and good luck. On the back of the letter, there was a hand-drawn map with the location of the jars. I didn't waste any time. I went to the temple right away. Ooh, creepy ominous temple! Oh, I hate it in here. Absolutely cannot stand it in here. I'll take my chances. Ooh, that's a lot of C4. Temple map. Do not enter? Oh, jeez. So the west hall, right to the left of the door, I feel like I have to plant C4 there. But maybe I don't? I don't know, dude. I'm scared. Oh, there's someone there! Oh, we're not going in there! Oh, jeez! We're not going into that inner west hall. Okay, we're gonna place the C4 here. Ooh. North hall. Oh! Without the factory, we will lose more members. Ever since the fire, his orders have been increasingly erratic. How many senators- Shh! Don't talk like that! Do you want to end up like the Packertons? Everything will work out. Just have faith, sister. The dissension will soon be upon us. Ooh, these guys are doing some- evil villain stuff. I just hope that I don't run into any of them because if I do, I will die! Oh, jeez. Come on, give me a place I can I can put the C4. Ooh! Ooh! Oh, I found one. E. All right, that's two- Ah! Jeez! All right, we're gonna do that again. We are dodging bullets. Left and- Oh, okay. All right. One. I'm gonna wait for this guy to leave. Uh, get out of my face! Two. Ash, we gotta be stealthy! What is this? Oi? What? What is that? Ooh, I don't like that thing. South Hall. Eh. Mmm. 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 
Okay, this is a circle at this point, so I'm gonna try to go a different way. Okay, I got two. Oh, so I have to go into the inner hall. All right. Oh boy. I'm gonna get caught. Oh, I'm gonna get caught. I'm gonna get caught hard. Mm. Mm. Come on, give me strength. Oh jeez, I'm so scared. Please move. Please. Move! Dude, why aren't you move? Okay, this guy's not gonna move. Should I take this door? Okay, it doesn't work, thank god. I was so scared. Mm. Oh, I really don't trust this. Bruh. Oh. No, already placed the C4 there. Hey, I got one. Oh! I better move from the spot quickly. Uh. Oh, jeez, God, no. Oh, no, 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 he's gonna come for me! Oh. No! Oh. Are any of these in the inner chamber? No, I just have to get to the other side. Bruh, this guy's not moving. This might be GG. I might have to start again. <gasps> no. Yeah, it's GG. Alright, back where we left off, I gotta place this. Run for my life. Run for my life. For your life! Ooh, because that guy just never moves for the rest of his life. So I've checked the inner east hall and the inner west hall. West hall, north hall. Okay, I gotta go. I'm gonna go on this side. Ooh. Get away! You're scaring me. I'm Ash. I can't stand this. Alright, I don't think I've been here before. South Hall. I definitely have. <laughs> But I haven't- I haven't gone on the right side of this map yet. I've got one more to place. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. We have to not die doing these. Placing some C4, I promise I won't hurt you. That's all of them. Got him. Gotta get out- not going to the dungeon. We're not going to the dungeon. Are we going to the dungeon? I don't want to go to the dungeon, but we might go to the dungeon. Ash, I'm here. I did it. I'm the queen. What are you doing? Neil, are you okay? I've had better days. How the heck did you get in here? I'll tell you later. Right now we gotta get out of here. What about Maple and Todd? Have you seen them? Maple is in the next cell over and Todd is here. I saw him when they dragged us here. <gasps> Maple? Oh, Maple. They have Todd in a different room. I'm not sure where though. They knocked me on the head pretty hard. Ash, I think something big is going down real soon. Something bad. Okay, did you see where they put the keys? I'll get you out, then we can get Maple and Todd. One of the guards has the keys, but it's too dangerous. Even if you could somehow get it, you and I aren't gonna be able to handle Maple and Todd. They're too far gone. We can do it. I know we can. We can't just blow them up in here. I think it's time for plan B. Neil? No. Save yourself, Ash. Someone has to live through this. I'm not leaving you guys down here. I can't lose any more friends. I don't think we have any other option. You there! Crap. Wait, I know that voice. Who are you? Travis! The schoolyard bully? You need to leave. If they catch you here, it won't end well. He's helping me? You look horrible, dude. What happened to you? Don't act like you give a crap about me. Just get out of here. Come on, man. Can you just help us get Maple and Todd? Let's all get out of here together. Trust me when I say it is beyond possible. I know there's some good in you, Travis. Sal saw it too. He stood up for you and no one else would. You know he did. Do this for him. Sal's dead, and you will be too if you stay in here any longer. Dang it, why won't you just help us? I'm trying to. He's right, Ash. You should go. But it's okay. I've made my peace with it. I'll finally be with my Todd again. Travis pretty much had to drag me out of there. I didn't want to go, even though I knew they were right. And I know that we planned to blow the temple up, even if we failed, but I couldn't do it. I couldn't bring myself to press that button, knowing that our friends are down there. If you're out there somewhere, please, Sal. I need your help, please. You can't be gone. Come on, Sal, give us an old hand, would you? Sal? Who? Episode five, memories and dreams. Ooh, I'm hype. I'm hype! It's happening again. The flashes. What am I? You are unbound. You are broken. You must balance yourself. Fight the chaos within. Don't let your nightmares infect your reality, Sal. Find your center. Don't listen to them, Sal. 
You must give in to your dreams. Give in to the chaos to reach your full potential. It's too dangerous. He's not ready. Follow your heart, child. No! Listen to your mind, not your heart. Have I been here before? You've Who always been me? here. Who are you? We are everything and nothing. Where am I? You are everywhere and nowhere. Ugh, never mind, you idiots. At least give me a hint. So vague. Whose house is this? A house in the void? I'm just a chillin' old dead Sal here. Ooh, I can either go upstairs or the white room. I don't know about the white room. Maybe I'll go upstairs first. Whoa. Uh, hello? I'm glad you remembered where I was. Do I know you? We've spoken many times, Sal. All right, are you gonna be as cryptic as the voices? H hold on. Jim? I was once. Well, part of me was. I've made many sacrifices to get here, and I've lost so much along the way. I guess that's a yes on the cryptic thing, then? I'm so sorry about your family. Evelyn, Lisa, Larry. Yes, I used to be as well. There was a time when I thought I could save them by changing the future. It was all I wanted. Lisa and Larry were the light of my life. I had never known such a deep love. Oh? I do not hold you responsible for their deaths. I understand what had to be done. You lost a lot that day too. But it is the nature of life. All living things must come to an end. I remember what it was like to live, to feel. I do not miss the constant cloud of emotions. It was all for nothing though. The shadows still live and the devourers are going to call forth the plague. The reach has grown too far. I stopped nothing. I died for nothing. I killed for nothing. You can still stop them if you wish to. In fact, you are the key to their destruction. If that means anything to you now. Is this that prophecy nonsense again? I don't think I'm much of a chosen hero. I couldn't save anyone. There are no chosen heroes, only ones who choose to do heroic acts. Win or lose, light or dark, good or evil. These things don't hold much significance to me anymore, but I would still like to help you if you so choose. How can I do anything like this? Upon dying, your soul was shattered. This occurrence has awakened a unique ability within you. You'll be able to drift into parallel worlds, though it'll take some practice. How do I get back to my world? It will be difficult, but I prepared for your arrival. I built a device to help you. Your friend, Ashley, has gathered the device above your grave in your world. This is good. However, there are more components and they must be aligned across three realities that they have been hidden in. The three pyramids of Asinja are each sealed within three puzzles. You must gather them all. If you hid these pyramids of Asinma or whatever, can't you just grab them for me? That is not possible. I can no longer intervene in such matters. I have also erased the solutions from my memory in case anyone tried to steal them. However, I can guide you to their locations. Okay, well, that'll save some time at least. Where do I start? There used to be a door here. Just a second. Uh, oh, there it is. Where? Open me up. You'll find your way through that door. Keep your wits about you. Are you okay, little buddy, Jim? All right, I gotta get these three pyramids. Or should I go to the white room before I go in the hallway? I'm gonna go in the white room first just to check what's it. Oh, oh, there's a dark room too. The black room? Yikes. The struggle of mankind ripples across the cosmos as they strive to escape the dust. Yet, all things must eventually return to the shadows. Okay, thank you. Can I leave, please? Get me out of here. Ah! All right. Hopefully the light room is nice and bright, chandeliers, cookies. The dawn of mankind has triumphed over the oldest conflict. They are something from nothing. You must not allow them to be extinguished. Okay, thank you, Mr. Light. Appreciate it. Off I go. There's a door to what I need here. Door number one. Oh, and there's lots of doors. Ah! Is this safe? Oh, geez. I'm afraid moving still isn't an option for us. The house has been on the market since, well, four years now. It's an important step that I hope you'll be able to take soon. In the meantime, I believe that the cat will be of great comfort to Sal. He's shown a lot of improvement over the past month after he was assigned to the kitten. Are you sure he's ready to come home? He's more than ready, Henry. Are you sure you're ready? Yeah, it'll be good to have my son back. Daddy? Whoa, this isn't what I was expecting at all. You have awakened a new soul connection. You may find it a bit strange at first. Actually, Feels pretty natural, like I've been here the whole time, like waking from a dream. In the beginning, I found the odd sense of familiarity to be unsettling, but I am not like you. Hmm. You'll find the first pyramid somewhere in this house. On it. Gonna find this pyramid. Ooh, that's sealed shut. Good old Tom's gotta hide his dirty little secrets. What is this, turn? Oh, geez. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go, oh, that's unfortunate. All right, all right. Okay, so this one. Oh, I did, okay, did it by accident, let's go. Wow, Sal looks like a cute little anime character right now. Well, we solved the issue in that room, what about this one? Oh, it's my old room. Is Gizmo here? Wait. 
I recognize this thing. It's from the temple. But I can't pick it up. Why is that? A photo? Oh, look at us. The old pals together. Ooh, what happened to the basement? It's jammed shut. All right, let's check out the bathroom. There's always weird things in the bathroom in Sally Face. It's gotta be something in here. Oh, 7842. 7842. I gotta find a way to the backyard. No, I don't. 7842. Let's go in. What? Seriously? All right, well, I gotta remember this for later then. I'm gonna try the opposite. No. Bruh. Yeah. A letter. Looks like a letter from Ashley. Sal, I'm sorry I didn't believe you before. I really wanted to, and I tried so hard to be there for everyone, and now it's all falling apart. I hope it's not too late to fix things, and I hope that I can somehow make up for my mistakes. I need you to know that I... It just ends there. Something must have interrupted her. Was that a little I love you? Hmm? I can't leave, I have to find that pyramid. Is there something here that I can use to unjam the basement? Cause I need to get outside. Maybe I'll check the bathroom once more just to make sure. 7842, I, I got it right. Come on, give, whoa. Okay, two codes. 5023, maybe that's the code that I need to get into old Todd's room. What? Is you serious? Well, at least I'm doing what I do best. Please somebody help me. Somebody help me. Okay, so I was in this room for literally an hour trying to figure it out. I didn't want you guys to like be bored watching me do this, but I added 145, cause like I noticed these two pluses on here. 145 to what's on the TV, 5023 to what's on the bathroom mirror and it worked. Although I did it once before and it didn't work, but then I went crazy and did it again and it did work this time. So hopefully the pyramid is, it is. Bruh. Bruh. I swear I heard him going straight to Sal's grave. I want to see if he's here. Please be. <gasps> Sal? Is that you? It's me. You sound faint. Why is your ghost like this? How is this possible? There's so many things I want to tell you. The pyramids. Oh, one of them is glowing now. This is closer to what Todd had in his notes. Let me take a look. Ooh. 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 Ooh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, gotta take a picture of that. Oh, what the heck? Give me the keys. Wait, this is like a whole code. I need to be placed around a corpse, got it? These symbols are some kind of code. Oh, I need to figure out where to place this thing and I don't know. Do I place it in the top? I don't know, I, I just wanna mess it up. So these are buttons that I have to press because this is the North uh, Pyramid. But then I do it and nothing happens. <laughs> these puzzles in this game are so hard. Maybe if I do the North one correctly, it'll light up. Ah! I guess I did it wrong the first time. You did it, Ash. Oh, but back here again. Well, on to the next one. All right, so door two, been there, done that. Door three, here we go. Wonder what kind of strange world we're about to go into. I'm scared. Dad, when will mom get out of the hospital? Do you think she'll recognize me with my new face? Dang it, Sal, can we not do this today? I just miss her. She's dead, duh. She's effing dead. Mom isn't coming home. Well, what about the man with the dog face? We've been over this. Nobody believes me, but I did see the dog man. That's enough, Sal. You're so mean to me. Oh, I'm gonna put my mask on and just sit there sad. I chose the pink one because that's mom's favorite color. I hope she'll recognize me with it on. Ugh. Oh, you. Ooh, this is an interesting, interesting kind of game here right now. I've been looking for this spot. I've spent so much time out in these woods searching for some evidence that this was real, that I wasn't losing my mind. The council went to great lengths covering it up. They had hidden it with a concealing spell, as they called it. Of course, what they consider magic is merely science that they don't understand. That makes sense, though I have to be honest. It's a pretty dreary way to explain magic. Anyway, I'm guessing you have some hidden things on your own around here? Yeah? The second pyramid is here. Oh. Oh, good luck to me. This is very open world. Okay, thank God there are some borders. Never mind. I can go as far left or right as I want. Come on, Sal, with your little pink mask. We're gonna find that second pyramid. Hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. What's all this? Whoa. Uh, yo, what is this? I can't even interact with it. Gonna have to take a picture of it. Might need her later. What is this? Oh no. I just don't even know. Oh, okay. I'm gonna light these babies up. Hey, oi, I figured something out. Okay, I gotta find other puzzles. I 
think I see another one over here. Wow, lucky I took that picture, huh? Okay, that's supposed to be a sun. This is supposed to be a sun. Moon, 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 sun. Yes! What? I got all of them? Let me at them. Give me my pyramids. Turn two. Turn one? What do you mean? Oh, I see, I see. Oh, geez. Like, two of these are, like, linked up in a way that I wish they weren't. Whoa! How do I keep accidentally solving these, like, really hard puzzles? <gasps> Another one lit up! Keep going, Ash. I'm getting stronger! You don't look so great. <laughs> At least you're not bones anymore, but I'm gonna figure this out. Let's get you back to normal. Oh, girl. We know. We know how to do this. All right, so this is the west one. Bang. Saul's coming back to life, yeah! All right, here we go. Door four, give it to me. I need all these pyramids. I need to get this done. Oh no, what kind of world are we going into next? How hard is it gonna be? I'm so scared. Are you ready for your first day of school, Sally? I don't know. It'll be fun. You'll get to meet a bunch of kids your age and make lots of new friends. What if they don't like me? That's impossible. You're the coolest guy I've ever met. Me? Of course. I don't want to leave you, Mommy. You don't have anything to be afraid of, my love. The teachers will take good care of you and I'll be right here when you get back. I love you. I love you the most, Sally. Don't you forget it. Oh, Mom, I miss you. Ugh. This is a nightmare before Christmas. Is this the cave by Wendigo Lake? I don't remember it being so big. Another illusion created by your favorite cult. Was that a joke from Mr. Serious? No, it's me, Jim Johnson. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go find the last pyramid. Godspeed. Thank you. Hop in this cave. Not afraid of anything. Ooh, hieroglyph. Oh, whoa, back off, dude. I'm tougher than I look, and I'm not afraid to put you down. Hey, I'm not here to cause any trouble. I'm just looking for something I lost. Aren't we all? Well, you better not try anything. I'm watching you. I promise I won't. My name is Sal Fisher. Tala Gray. So what are you doing in these caves, Sal Fisher, besides sneaking up on people? I was just about to ask you the same question. I don't think I've ever seen you around Knockville before. My relatives are from here. I don't visit too often, but my grandfather has recently gone missing. Ooh. Unfortunately, that tends to happen a lot around here. I hope you find him. Thanks. My grandfather was fascinated by these caves. He used to tell me that our ancestors made all of these paintings. He said they depicted a warning of a hungry beast that hunts in this land. Uh, uh, have you seen a small metal pyramid around? Please. <laughs> If she just went like, yeah, awesome, and then handed it to me, that would be so nice. A small pyramid, huh? I'm guessing that's a thing you lost? Yeah. I haven't seen anything like that around here. Sorry. Oh, pff. what about some turny hexagons or something? You're just out here with a mask on looking for a bunch of shapes, huh? It's a prosthetic. Well, I'm sorry I couldn't be more help to your geometry. Yeah, don't be sorry, you idiot kill you tomorrow. Let me walk past you. Thanks, baby. What? Oh, I see a pyramid there. Whoa, that's a big scary cave down there. Give me my pyramid! Oh, what's all this? I can't interact with it. Help me. What are, wait, oh, here they are. Here's my turnies. I'm the best. I'm actually like, I, this brain is, this brain, I can't even contain how big this brain is right now. It doesn't even fit on the camera. Can no. Yeah, like actually, like my, I just gotta hide my brain somewhere. I don't understand what's happening, but the third one is activated now. Will this bring you back? My ghost will be able to interact, but my body cannot be revived. Are you sure? The prophecies are vague, but they suggest that you'll take physical form. I'm not sure of uh, anything. All right, let me take care of this last pyramid. Let me handle this for you. Sal? <laughs> Dang it, this was supposed to resurrect you, are you okay? I, uh, oh, it hurts. There's another part to Todd's notes, but I haven't been able to make much sense of them. I'm so sorry, Sal, I failed you again. You deserve better than this. You deserve better than me. Wait, I think I know what he means. I know what I have to do. Oh, don't you dare. Ash, uh, don't. I would gladly die if it means that you will live. This is how I can make up for everything I've messed up. No, Ash, no, no. Go save them, Sally Face. I hope we meet again. No. No! Ash, no! Girl, you didn't have to cut it that deep. Oh, no, what am I gonna do in this world without Ash? How many loved ones will you kill to save the world? What will be left worth saving? Well, apparently nothing, Mr. Voice of the Dark. Are you okay, Larry? Yeah, dude, I just... I, uh, just got something in my eye. I told you this movie is emotional, Ari. It's just so beautiful. 
I hope they end up together in the end. They deserve happiness after all this stuff they've been through. Yeah. Hey, Larry? What's up? Do you... Do you think that anyone could ever love me like they love each other? Who wouldn't love you? Don't be stupid. You're Sally Face. You're perfect, dude. Oh, I miss Larry. Of course Neil can move in. I'm surprised it took you this long to ask, honestly. His current lease is nearing its end now, which is why I waited. I'd be happy to have him at our place. I'm sure Larry will too, though Larry probably won't move in until next year. Right. Well, thank you. Neil will be excited to hear the news, and I'll be very glad to have him close by again. Oh, Todd, we're moving in together. Oh, there he goes. Larry, Todd, ugh. What's wrong, Sal? It's Ash. I'm just no good at this. I'm sorry for wasting your time. You've got nothing to apologize for. I've been having a great time painting with you. You're an amazing artist, Ash, and a wonderful teacher. I'll never be as good as you, though. Sure you can. All it takes is practice and determination, but only if you want it. You know, you don't have to be good at everything you do. Some things we just do because they're fun and we like doing them, or even just to spend time with people we like. I guess you're right, and I have been enjoying this time together. Very much so. I'm glad to hear that. Anytime you want to paint or even just hang out, you let me know. Ashley. I wish you'd have seen yourself the way I did. You weren't a failure in my eyes. You were always there for me. You gave me hope when I needed it most, even when you saw the horrible things I had done. Even when you couldn't believe the reasons I had to do those things, you stood by me, and that means everything. The ritual requires one final step. Seize the power of the Blade of Osiris. Oh, I guess I'll seize that power. Ash, no. <gasps> oh, jeez, no. <laughs> What's happening to me? Oh! You, she looks like Travis. Ash, can you hear me? Sal, where are you? The ritual has awakened a power within my being, but I can't return to your world. You must be my sword in the darkness. This power I feel. Oh, this is you? Yes. Holy crap, Sal. Yeah, tell me about it. Whoa. Oh, I can slap stuff around. Whoa. Thank you for trusting me with this. I couldn't have obtained this power on my own, Ash. It's all thanks to you. Let's go kick some cultist butt! Yeah! We're going- wait, can I wear the mask? Nope. Alright. Let's get out of here. I'm gonna slap some people silly. I am mad. And I'm so happy that Ash is alive! Man, if that was the end of her, I just would've- oof, it would've been tough. Ooh, there's the exit. Here we go! Hello? Ash is here! Where is everyone? Oh no, don't tell me that they're in the basement doing some freaky stuff. Can I whack the door open? Okay, I can't. I just have to find the dungeon. What is this? The center chamber is sealed shut. How are we gonna get in there? I think I can get us in. All right, I am Sal. I am doing some searching. What? Uh, huh? Oh dude, these are some old notes about the prophecies and the devourers of the gods. The first shadow is successfully summoned. These cosmic predators are relentless. The studies show they can be contained and even destroyed by strong enough sources of ultraviolet light, but only when not possessing a host. Ultraviolet light, maybe that's what we need. Anyone got a lamp? A safe. Oh jeez. All right, I gotta back off and find the code to this safe. There's a code to this too. Yikes. And this is all that I have. What? Um. Uh oh, spaghettios. Oh. What even? I the Yo, I couldn't tell you, and I wouldn't tell you, dude. There's no more thing there. Ah! I thought I could leave and come back. What the heck is this thing? I need to find a way to open the center chamber first. But how? Maybe it's in the notes. There's so many numbers in these notes. Whoa, oh, uh, 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 I, I just typed in the initiation number. I just thought that the last date, maybe I would try my luck with that, and it worked. Lisa, I know that you and Larry must hate me for leaving. It was the hardest thing I ever had to do. It shattered my heart. Maybe it doesn't mean anything now, but I need you to know that I left to protect you both. I thought I could keep you safe by keeping it all secret. I've gotten mixed up with some dangerous people, and they were threatening to hurt you if I didn't join them. I believe they're also responsible for our stillborn daughter, though I haven't found hard proof of that. Now now they're planning a mass murder of children across the globe. They think that these kids are a threat to them. I have to stop this from happening. This dang cult is dealing with powerful forces they don't understand. I've been secretly sabotaging their efforts where I can, but I'm going to need to take greater action to stop the killings. It's likely I won't survive this. I hope that you and Larry can forgive me. Above anything, I hope that you will both have long and fulfilling lives and that you will find happiness. I love you with all the pieces of my broken heart. Jim. Dang. Okay. Oh, this, this is easy. Okay. I'm just gonna open. Okay, so this middle switch corresponds to the right switch. Hmm. She's a toughie. I, I, 
can't, I can't explain. I don't know, I'm just fondling. I'm just fondling with stuff. I'm just fumbling. Mumble rapping. Center chamber should be open now. Let's get the heck out! Okay, let's get in that center chamber. Let's keep our weapons ready. Oh, I'm scared. We've been expecting you. What have you done? The final dissension is upon us. On this night, mankind will triumph over God. You killed them, all of them. And many others. We are destined to be so much more than- Shut up, you psycho. I'm gonna end you. I thought you might feel that way at first. Oh yeah, come at me. Come at me, I got moves. What bent? See ya, come get me. What pow? You like that? Ash is mad. She's got turbo arm syndrome. Gonna have tennis elbow after all these thrashings. Bang. More. Let's take- Hello? Todd! Don't worry. We're gonna get you out of this. Sal? Is that you? Oh. Larry! Oh, you look holy now. Are you, are you okay? I didn't think I'd ever see you again. What happened? When the treehouse burned, I was lost in the void. I spent so long there, dude. Like, really long. I can tell. I like the beard, though. <laughs> But yeah, there was this weird, like, tree. The roots of it were all cosmic-y and stuff, and creatures gathered around it and worshipped it. They called it the Mother Tree. I'm still not really sure how it helped me find my way back. I think I've seen that, or, or felt it before. You're connected to it. We all are. Larry, uh, about Lisa, I- Dude, you don't need to say anything. I know, but I- <sighs> It's okay, seriously. All of their souls would have been destroyed. I'm glad your soul didn't dissolve into the void. Not yet, at least, though. Todd was right about the whole second death thing. Souls fade into the void and become nothing. It sounds brutally final, but I didn't learn much beyond that. Do you know how we can save Todd? I think I can get him out. I'm surprised he's lasted this long, to be honest. Look at him hanging over there. He's always had a strong will. Oh, I have something for you. I found it in the void. A guitar? Leave Todd to me. You need to hold back the shadows. They're starting to seep in. Okay, be careful. You too. Oh, I love you, Larry. You're my best friend. They're here. Ooh. Game over? Oh, I was supposed to run? Oh, rest in peace. They're here. All right, off we go. No! Ow! Okay, okay, I gotta figure out what to do. I have to figure They're here. <laughs> Yo, what do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? Oh, whoop-pam. Got him. Hit my butt, you red-eyed boing. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, looks like this little guy wants to land my head. Whoa. Can I whack? Can I whack? Yo, yo, get a... Oh, gosh, this is scary. Don't you dare. Don't. Yo. Oh. Okay, listen, I'm gonna let you drop. Ah! Okay, I'm just gonna have to wait till you drop because I'm not gonna let you drop on me. No, I'm not. Okay, let me, let me doink you. I can't doink him. Yo, go away. Let me hit you. That's what you get. Three times you're out, huh? Someone's gonna lose and it ain't me. Eh, yeah, it's gotta hurt, don't it? Whoa, who's this? Travis! I won't let you do this. I used to be a bully, but I'm a good guy now. Your betrayal is not surprising. You always were a disappointment. Stop it, Travis is gonna have more daddy issues. The feeling is mutual, you prick! You know you can't stop this, son. Oh, Travis, you can't die. Travis! Ah! Ashley, get out of here now. It can't end like this. We have to, I have to. Detonate. Oh, gee, bongo, bongo, ooh, the jungle. Okay, I'm gonna not do it. Oh, okay, I think that was a good idea. I just didn't want Ashley to die. Larry is out here. Like, these ghosts are doing the most to get Larry. Oh, I can take you. Bang. You want some more? You want some more of this, huh? Larry can do this all night. L Larry's got magical powers. Uh-oh. Oh, it's you, Todd. I got you, Todd. Hold on, buddy. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, 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 I keep hitting T instead of R. I am such an actual bot. All right, here we go. I can do this. Let's strafe a little. Bang, bong, shink, yee, ah, no. Oh, can I kill two at once? No, at least these ones are slower. Oh my goodness. I've never been so stressed in my life. Oh, oh. hey, I did it. Ash, oh, Ash, use your whackers. Use that whacker! 
girl power. Equalization between the sexes. Wow! No, please. We are everlasting. Hey. Oh no, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me, bro. No. Oh, I'm gonna get killed by a vine. No, you don't. Just please, just get out. No, listen. I can't handle the stress. I, oh! oh. Three chairs? For me, Ash and Larry? Hmm? All you can eat buffet? Dinner, oh, jeez. Ew. The creator of all things decays in our bowels. Its power is surging through our veins. I don't believe you. A broken soul resisting what is inevitable, yet we are eternal and have surpassed God itself. You will soon become one with the endless. We are the final stage of all humanity. I'll never join you. I don't know what you're talking about. Look how cute my face is. Oh no. Listen, oh. There's a learning curve here. Okay, kill that one. Come on, open up. Ooh, jeez. Oh, no, no, no! <laughs> this is like mini game death. I can't, okay, aiming with this is. I wonder if I can use my mouse. It's like, wow, we. No, you can't. Oh, this one's gonna be a tough one. Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Oh, I missed! No, oh, it's so hard! It's so hard! It's so hard! Okay, come on, I'm ready. Just don't come at me faster than you have. Oh, okay, it's, I can't. This, this is. If I could use a mouse, I would be very, very thrilled, very happy. Alright, you got this. Shh. You got it. Shh. I need to focus. This is really tough for me. Hoi! No! What do you mean? Uh, yo, what do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, Sally Face meets Cuphead! Let's go! Let me through! I've got my guitar and my power. Oh, oh no, not this again. Oh, not this again. Oi. Yo, I... I'm not sure what you mean. Oh. Oh! Ah! I didn't know I was supposed to kill the balls. I thought maybe I could just dodge them. Every time I let a ball pass, the mouth closes. Oh, this... My range, though. My range, not very good. My range! Please, let me... Okay, I need to start again. We're gonna get him this time. We gonna beat him. Oh. Oh, yikes. use that healing arm. Hey, are you okay? Larry? It's good to see you, Ash. I, uh, I like the new look. When did you get so old? It's a long story. When did you get all glowy? Long story. It's over. We did it. Why does it feel so bad? Are you sure it's over? Seems like it, but I just, uh... Todd, you're alive. What, where, what, what happened? I think we stopped them. I'm glad you're okay, dude. Good to have you back, Todd. We'll fill you in on the details later, after we get you patched up. There's a lot to talk about. I just want you all to know how much you mean to me. I love you guys so much. I was lucky to know you. I'm glad I got to see you all again. We love you too, Larry. Are you all right? I'm sorry, I, I didn't have much time left. Larry. I didn't think I'd be afraid when, I just wish I had more time. Larry, no. What? No, where did he? He can't leave again. We just got him back. Was that La Larry? Yeah. Maybe we'll see him again someday on the other side of oblivion, if there is such a place. Oh, jeez. <gasps> oh, that's the end. 
That's a lot of stuff. Check me out, Gloom Games, and the special thanks. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, man. I have to say, Sally Face was amazing. It was such a fun adventure. It was the ominous and just kind of unsettling ending that I was hoping for, very much in the nature of Sally Face. There was so much to be unpacked. There was so much that we had to deal with to see everything to the end. And the something I like about it is that there's so many questions that are unanswered. There's so much that I'd still really like to know, but I think that a beautiful thing about this game is all of the mystery that's intertwined in it and that the characters are just so unique and so lovable. I completely understand why there's a big fandom surrounding this game because this game is just, a it's actually incredible and it's gonna be a long time before another indie game this good comes out. So it's good that we got to enjoy it while it lasted. That was Sally Face episode five. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you'd like to see me again, make sure you hit push notifications. If you'd like to play this game, please buy it and support Steve Gabry. We need to encourage indie developers developers to make awesome games like this because this was truly spectacular. Steve really went all in for this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you on the next one.